Good morning, everyone, and uh, welcome to our family time worship for uh, for Sunday, May the thirty first. It's almost so, June, buddy. Yeah, we're, it's in fact it's twelve more days until my birthday, June tenth to be exact. Yeah. And I hope some of you guys can come to my Skype birthday. Yeah, we'll have to we'll have to send people invitations. Yeah. All right. So, what 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 do you think we're gonna talk about today? I don't know. I don't even. But why is this the obstacle here? Well, well, why is there a fan? Well, the I fan because we're gonna we're gonna talk about action. we're why gonna talk about something that it, you can't see it, but it can be very powerful, and that's the what do you think? Wind. The wind. Yes. So uh, how? The wind can be pretty powerful. It's actually pretty windy outside right now, right? Yeah. So how, how, so how can you see the wind? Um, well, you can see the wind in tornadoes and hurricanes. Oh, yeah, you can see the wind in clouds. So let's, let's, make, let's make a cloud. Water should be boiling any second. Oh, there it goes. Look at that. Look, at, I like that noise there. Mm -hmm. And pretend the light from the phone here is the sun. Yeah. Alright. And that, pretend yeah, it's... Put that down, it'll make the... And be pretend able to... it's incinerating the water, which is making it evaporate and turning it into clouds. Yeah, we'll have a cloud in a second. Alright, what? Um, what let's else? just use some phone light to help with that. Well, you, you want to have the light nice down, down low so it'll show up? I had this. Oh, there's, there's, oh, I'm not sure if you can see it, but there's, it. there's the steam. It's like a cloud, and then we turn on. Wind. The wind. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> hey, turn on. Whoa. Look at that rapid boil. That boils yeah, rapid. I, can see. Oh. I kind of actually blew the, blew the whole cloud away. Yeah. It was there, and then it was gone. And that's actually how the clouds move across the sky. Did you know it's the wind moving the clouds across the sky when you see that? No. Yeah, it's clouds just... are actually surprisingly very heavy. Yeah. It can be as heavy as two elephants, in theory. Yeah, yeah. and the wind moves them along at that incredible speed sometimes. As you can see... Oh, yeah, you can see as, it. As in this demonstration here, yeah. this... As it blows. Tell your full power, Daddy. Whoa. And see how powerful it can be. Wow, yeah, on a windy day, it's like, it can blow the leaves of the trees, it can blow some things around. And it can, Whoa. and it's so, the wind is mm. so strong. Yeah. And let how about, get, let me just make get lots some, of let me clouds. get some, let me get some, see here, oh, oh, I'm going to show you how powerful the wind can be. Oh, just, just wait, there's another thing. Let's put this water on. Let's see. <laughs> what happened? Yeah. yeah. Now, nobody's shaking the table. Look at how the water's moving. Yeah. Did you know that the waves on the sea are caused by the wind too? Yeah. When it's a when it's a big stormy day and lots of wind, the, the, the wind can move the waves and, and move lots of other things too, right? Yeah, and it can also move these pole ponds. Yeah. Whoa! Whoa! And you can see they're rolling off the table. Whoa. You yeah, so the wind can be very, very powerful. But it can also, of course, be gentle. On a, and a nice nice breeze on a hot day, doesn't that feel good? Yeah. I'm just going to demonstrate one more thing for the power Oh, I, th I, th I think we're just going to we're gonna move on to the story, buddy, okay? So, all right, so let's move our, our wind demonstration things. And the story that we're talking about today is Pentecost. And that is the day Nathan. when G the Holy Spirit was given to the church. Jesus had promised right from the beginning, he said, that well, actually John the Baptist, even before Jesus started his ministry, said, one is coming who will baptize you with the Holy Spirit, <laughs> immerse you in the Holy Spirit. And Jesus said, now that I'm turning to, to heaven, to my Father, we had the Ascension story last last couple of weeks, right? <laughs> um, and when I when I go up, to, to heaven to be with my father I will send you the Holy Spirit and that will come upon you in a few days time and so on Pentecost uh, which 15, was or a few days later yeah about 10 days later uh, Jesus disciples were gathered they were gathered together and they had been waiting for the promise to come true 
And uh, that morning, as they were gathered, there was a sound like a great rushing wind blowing through the house where they were staying. And tongues of flame appeared over their heads. And they were filled with God's Spirit. And, that, and the Spirit sent them out into the streets of the city to tell people about Jesus, but tell people about Jesus in their own language, because there were people from all over the world there. Jewish people living in all different countries, speaking all different kinds of language. And the disciples were speaking the language of all these different people, dozens of different languages. And they were like, what is happening? And the Spirit was giving them power. In, in the languages that they were speaking. Yeah. The Spirit was giving them power to share good news about Jesus. And as they would go on, they would be able to do everything that Jesus had done. To heal people. To give them hope. Uh, and to, to bring good... To grab a fistful of black holes. To grab a fistful of black holes. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. So this, this, and, and the power to go. <laughs> so this, the spirit, the spirit gives God, us power to do things for God, to share God's blessing with the world, and to do to, to love our neighbor. Let's let's not get carried away, okay? <laughs> All right, I think I've lost them, but just remember today. Bye bye. Oh, I'm not saying bye bye yet. God the Spirit gives us power to, to share good news, to share hope, to bring healing, and to help people. Jesus gives us this power by the Holy Spirit. And the, you know, the other thing is, you know, you think wind, when the wind blows, does it just stay in one spot or does it travel from place to place? Place to place. That's the other thing. He did get water on the floor. He did get water on the floor. Well, the Spirit, as it travels from place to place, means that even though we're in separate houses, we're not together, we've not been able to be together for a long time, but the Spirit, like the wind blowing from place to place, blows <laughs> through our lives ball. and connects us all <laughs> by the same Spirit. Like a ball rolling down the hill. Yeah. All right. <laughs> let's, let's, let's take some time to pray, guys, and then we'll wrap up our, our time together. All right? Let's pray. At least a little quiet time, okay? <laughs> okay. All right. Dear God, we thank you for the gift of your Holy Spirit that you give us through Jesus, your Son, who gives us power and the ability to do the things that, that you have done, Lord Jesus, to share good news of God's kingdom, to share good news that our God is love, to show God's love by helping people, by bringing healing and peace. Thank you for always giving us your Spirit, like you gave it long ago on Pentecost. Help us to know your Spirit in our lives today. We pray all this in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, guys. Well, we, that was a lot of fun, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah. yeah. And, hey. and we'll see you again uh, next week. We're going to have a, a communion service by Zoom, but there will also be a family time video ahead of it as well. So until then, take care. God bless. Can, can you put that gun in? <laughs> be well, everybody. Bye-bye.